हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू किरण दाता यूट्यूब चैनल टुडे वी विल सी द कंप्लीट प्रोजेक्ट ऑफ द डोर ट्रिम्स विद द फिजिकल पार्ट्स ऑफ द असेंबली ऑफ द डोर ट्रिम्स वन बाय वन डिटेल्स सो दिस ऑफ स्नैप गिवन टू दिस पुल कप सो यू हैव टू फिक्स विद दिस आर्म रेस्ट जस्ट बाय प्रेसिंग लाइक दिस देन दिस वन नीड टू कंप्लीटली असेंबल विद द डोर विथ दिस वन so in this again having a snaps so that's it so i will cover each and everything so watch video till the end and get all knowledge related to door trims take the online classes for the automotive plastic product design interior exterior trims using the katia so download my play store app by the name kiran data you will get the pre recorded classes also i will provides the live online classes so connect with me on given contact number so friend first we will cover the list of the part of the door trims bomb of the door trims or the component one by one so we will divide this door into two sides upper door and the lower door so in upper door first one component is the this complete part is the waist rail we can say this one is the waist rail second one component inside this waist rail is this window or pocket given for the IRL means inner release lever which is used to open the door so that some assembly is put it here that is the second part first part is waist rail second part is the inner release lever now we will move to the third part so third part is the arm rest so this one is the our arm we can rest like this on this component so in that having the three integrated part so first one is what first one is this one is the pull cup we can use to pull the door this one is the grab handle to hold the door for pushing and pulling purpose and next one is the purpose for the comfortness which is the arm rest purpose so this one is the assembly then this one is the upper door assembly then the lower door assembly is the component is mainly mac pocket so mac pocket inside having the bottle holder as well as magazine holder so we can put the notebook notes some papers or the bottle so that we can say as a mac pocket and the next one is this component which is the tweeter or speaker grill so this one is the speaker grill so the shape of speaker grill the shape and profile of the mac pocket the shape and profile of the pull cup shape and profile of the grab handle inner release this uh, waist rail arm rest are different but these are the commonly minimum component in every door trim of any vehicle we have to see this from the back side also because we are more interested with the back side because as a design engineer we are focus with the how it will get assembled in assembly related we are more focusing so again i will repeat the component so top one is the waist rail in that in that having this window here is some mechanism assembly come which is the release lever inner release lever below to that this one is given for the what this one is given this completely given for the arm rest trims okay arm rest cover trims so in that having this one is for the grab handle because that grab handle is passing through this to uh, directly attach with the BIW because more force acts while pulling and pushing the door so this two given attachment for the direct to BIW so next one is this one component which is the mag pocket or bottle holder or magazine holder we can say and next one is this one speaker grill so inside having the tweeter or speaker is fitted now between the biw sheet metal part and this trims plastic part they are having a sandwich kind of assembly that will be assembled with this final dog house with the retainer pin or push pin inside having the power window mechanism this lighting some light will be there then that harness connector this speaker grill uh, harness wires come so that are things then this inner release assembly will be there so this we will see by one by one component as a part so 
now this one assembly some assembly are done from a side and some are assembled from the b side so some are assemblies so these are the features which is the locator and fixations for the assembly purpose and some are the reefs and gadgets given so out of that some are fitted from front side means a side so i will show you that so this one is the assembly which one assembly the pull cup grab handle and the next one is armrest that are assembled from the a side so this one is the pull cup the function is to pull the door so this one is the pull cup snap is given for this pull cup so this is the snaps fitted for the pull cup so with the help of this snap it will get mount on this one so if you see the profile and the shape of this pull cup see it will be automatically fit like this if someone try to fix not able to fix shape is like that so this one is one kind of poka okay not as mirror kind part or both side and uh, edges are not similar so you can blindly fit to this one into this one like this now this one is completely fit with this one so this assembly is completely from the a side like this that's it and the other than this that assemblies are put fix and putted from the back side now my questions to you which one is this door because four door is there and plus one tailgate so which one is this door it's a front right side left side or back right side or left side how you can identify this so you can easily identify with this profile so this one is the fitment or the environment part of ip ip means instrument panel or dashboard so this one is what this one is the front right side door okay so you can identify easily like this so we will focus now on to b sides now we will see what kind of input required to design the one by one component so this one is the waste rail this one is the waste rail so for waste rail design what will be the fitment part this front side area is the ip dashboard is the fitment or environment or surrounding part then this back side this area is the b pillar right side b pillar is the fitment part right then at the same times this uh, lever assembly is required to design this part at the same time this whatever is the armrest that are as a peripheral part required as a fitment part so we have to understand the input required for each and every part at the same time we required the environment surrounding or the peripheral part okay so once you understand the function then the fitment part environment surrounding parts you have then you can start the working or creating the benchmarking so same if you want to design the grab handle pull cup mag pocket then this one is in uh, liter capacity then the pull cup is the whatever push or pull force applied on this in newton each and everything at the same time which color which surface finish required how is the texture required now this one is the flash flash between these two part so the level of this surface with this surface is denoted as the flush so we are tried to make minimum flush as zero okay so see here once one part is finished and second part is start so whatever the level of the two parts should be zero zero that called as a flush so see flush between waste rail and this armrest flush between any kind of two parts flush between this speaker grill to lower door so flush between this mag pocket with this one inside so that should be zero zero now second one will be the gap so uh, we are discussing assembly requirement so gap should be plastic to plastic 3 mm 4 mm 5 mm depends upon company and the projects or the oem that need to confirm at the same time if you go from back side then all features will come into picture so 
we are more interested with these things so now i will cover each and every thing so video may be a big size so video is the lengthy watch till the end it will definitely help you to understand the complete door dreams project this complete door is fitted on the bw door because this one is the trim inner door plastic made so this one you we have to fix with the metal sheet metal bw door so that are fitted with this dog house whatever is the peripheral dog house so that are the final fixation because this is sub assembly done previously and this complete assembly is fixed with this fitment whatever given with the help of this dog house return pin on the bw so this one is the pin push pin or the return pin so you can easily disassemble this from the bw so on this dog house this one you have to, this one is the standard item so you have to push this like this and then this one is mounted on each dog house at the peripheral of the door if you see at every dog house this one is mounted so what you have to do you have to assemble like this as trim and directly match this hole with the directly match this hole with the bw part and directly push the door so your trims will be fitted with the bw now we will see one by one sub assemblies of the only plastic components so now one by one we will cover how it will attached or assemble so this one is the waist rail attached with the upper door trims and this one is the fitment given for the BW purpose okay and these are ribs or gadgets given to strengthening the part because this one is the top side of the door see so here it's a chances to get the load so due to that you need to make this corner as strengthful na? so how you will make it strengthful because in plastic the standard guideline is to follow the uniform thickness so you cannot exceed some thickness then we have to add the strength with the help of this gadgets or rip so these are the interface given or the cutout given for the BIW fixation purpose or the location purpose and just below of it it will be fixed with the welding cylinder or the heat stack so this one is the welding cylinder or heat stack on to the waste rail so one feature is on rest feature is integrated part of one component and the cutout is the integrated part of other component so now welding cylinder or heat stack is on the waste rail and the cutout or the simple hole given on the this armrest part so that is the thing now this cutout is given for the IRL and this one is the dog house given for the BIW fixation ok so this one is related to waste rail color is black and the finish from A side is the C this one is the texture finish you can able to see so this one we can say as a graining or the texturing it's not a shiny na? if you see like this so if you see this one so this one is the shiny and smooth part if you see this one here also some kind of texture is given so same this one is the texture and it's a having the graining and texture pattern so depends upon this pattern we have to clear this one is in draft analysis from 3 degree to 9 degree or sometimes up to 12 degree also how the fine and coarse or dense or depth texture is there in microns right now we will move towards the second part so second part is the this armrest fitted with the lower door and the waist rail armrest is fitted with waist rail with lower door so that also fix with the now heat stack or the welding cylinder so heat stack is on lower door and the cutout on the armrest part so on this part there will be a no features on this part only holes will be there so one part having the cutout means hole hole means how it will be it's maybe cylindrical or elongated types oval shape 
और स्क्वेर कट आउट और द रेक्टेंगुलर कट आउट दैट्स आर द फोर टाइप्स अवेलेबल वन राउंड शेप और द सर्कल वन इज द स्क्वेर नेक्स्ट वन इज द रेक्टेंगुलर और द वू होल और द इलिप्टिकल टाइप शेप सो दैट आर द असेंबली सो नेक्स्ट वन इज नेक्स्ट वन इज द धीस मैक पॉकेट सो मैक पॉकेट इज फिटेड विथ लोअर डोर अगेन सेम सो धीस वन इज द फ्लेंज क्रिएटेड बिकॉज वॉट एवर द ये सर्फेस यू रिसीव अप टू धीस पॉइंट ओनली यू ऑप्सिटेड दैट बट यू कैन नॉट फिक्स विथ दैट ना सो यू हैव टू एक्सटेंड फ्रॉम द बी सर्फेस सो वॉट एवर इज धीस वन इज द फ्लेंज क्रिएटेड फॉर द फिक्सेशन पर्पज सो इफ यू सी धीस वन इज द बी सर्फेस अपोजिट ऑफ इट ए सर्फेस बट दैट ए सर्फेस वी कैन से एज अ नॉन ए क्लास सर्फेस बिकॉज दैट आर द हिडन सर्फेस सो दैट आर वेल्डेड विथ द हेल्प ऑफ वेल्डिंग सिलेंडर और हिट स्टैक सो नेक्स्ट वन इज दिस पिकर ग्रिल सो इन दिस कॉम्पोनेंट द मॉडल ऑफ दिस वेकल इज द लोअर वन सो ड्यू टू दैट धिस वन इज द इंटीग्रेटेड पार्ट सो देर इज नो एनी असेंबली बट इन सम केसेस दैट आर आर द डिफरेंट पार्ट सो यू हैव टू असेंबल दैट विथ द लोअर डोर नाउ हाउ स्पीकर विल बी माउंट ऑन धिस सो धिस वन इज द स्क्रू बॉस इज गिवन सो स्पीकर विल बी माउंट विथ द हेल्प ऑफ धिस स्क्रू बॉस नाउ फॉर धिस ग्रैब हैंडल ग्रैब हैंडल फिक्सेशन ऑल्सो हियर स्क्रू बॉस इज स्क्रू इज गिवन सो अपोजिट पार्ट मीन्स फिटमेंट और इन्वायरमेंट पार्ट हैविंग द स्क्रू बॉस एंड हियर हैविंग जस्ट कट आउट मीन्स फोल्स और वी कैन से एज अ इंटरफेस ना वी हैव टू सी द कंप्लीट डोर इन टर्म्स ऑफ फ्रॉम इनपुट टू लास्ट प्रोडक्शन सो वॉट विल बी द सिक्वेंस फर्स्ट वन इज द इनपुट रिसीव्स दैन असेंबली फिजिबिलिटी टूलिंग फिजिबिलिटी मटेरियल फिजिबिलिटी ऑल थिंग्स एंड द सर्फेस फिनिश रिक्वायरमेंट एस्थेटिक्स रिक्वायरमेंट सो ना दिस वन इज वन काइंड ऑफ थिंग ना लोअर डोअर फिक्स विथ कंप्लीट डोअर पेरीफेरी हैविंग द डॉग हाउस ना टू फिक्स द डोअर ऑन द बी आई डब्ल्यू शीट मेटल पार्ट नीड अ रिटेनर पीन सो ना रिटेनर पी रिटेनर पीन फिक्स विथ द डॉग हाउस सो धीस वन इज द डॉग हाउस सो धीस पीप इज प्रोवाइडेड फॉर टू रिस्ट्रिक्ट धीस पीन धीस पीप विल हेल्पफुल नेक्स्ट ना आई हैव टू मेक धीस फिजिबल If for the tooling feasibility, then how to make it feasible for tooling? Because we have to assemble the individual parts one by one. Then you go for the assembly, uh, sub assembly and final assembly. Now to make this part feasible, you have to do the tooling feasibility. Then for tooling feasibility, see if you are able to see this marking. So this marking is the what? lifter parting line means for to clear this undercut now this one is the undercut so to clear this undercut you need the lifter mechanism and you need at least this much space free to clear this undercut so that is the tooling feasibility so how much is this undercut so we can calculate that so see it's a 30 mm 30 to 40 mm 35 mm undercut so to clear that undercut we need the same distance plus lifter block size and plus clearance so that much space we have to keep free then only your lifter mechanism will work so now if you go for the welding kind of purpose so this one is the welding cylinder so whatever the diameter of this welding cylinder before welding we need to see so after welding what rivet size will done that also need to check okay then next one whatever this flat surface created if you see na this profile will different and this one we need to create that impression and depression now this one is the impression all are above to this your base profile that we can say as a impression if somewhere that are below of that profile then we can say as a depression so why we have to do this because this surface should be normal with your tooling direct assembly direction this surface should be normal with your assembly direction because this all point whatever is this all points are get welded at a single stage at a one time so all should be touch or connect 
परपेंडिकुलर विद दिस सर्फेस बिकॉज युअर सोनोड रॉड विल कम परपेंडिकुलर विद दिस नाउ इफ यू गिवन एज अ स्क्रू बॉस नाउ हियर गिवन एज अ स्क्रू बॉस हियर ऑल्सो गिवन एज अ स्क्रू बॉस सो यू हैव टू मेक दैट स्पेस फ्री सो यू कैन एबल टू ऑपरेट द टूल वॉट एवर स्क्रू ड्राइवर दैट यू हैव टू ऑपरेट ना सो टू ऑपरेट यू हैव टू मेक द फ्री स्पेस फॉर द एक्सेसिबिलिटी पर्पज फॉर असेंबली डिसेंबली सो हियर ऑल्सो सी हियर स्क्रूज आर गिवन सो सच असेंबली विल बी देअर सो यू हैव टू डिसाइड डिपेंड्स अपॉन द फंक्शन ऑफ द पार्ट रिक्वायरमेंट ऑफ द प्रोजेक्ट एंड द कॉस्ट ऑफ प्रोजेक्ट देन यू विल गेट द ये सर्फेस लाइक धीस आफ्टर फुल्ली असेंबली बट वी आर मोर इंटरेस्टेड विद द बी साइड सो आई विल कवर्स द प्रैक्टिकल लेवल एक्चुअल वर्क एक्सपीरियंस ट्रेनिंग सो प्लीज डाउनलोड माई ऐप फ्रॉम द प्ले स्टोर लिंक गिवन इन डिस्क्रिप्शन और मैसेज मी ऑन व्हाट्सअप सो वी कैन कनेक्ट एंड आई विल गाइड यू बेटर थैंक यू